Prague is a wonderful historical city. You can find everything here from the ancient period to the contemporary. There are plenty of old buildings which are not really energy saving. The biggest challenge is for Prague how to make those buildings smart and energy efficient. The National Theatre is a combination of an old building and a new building, not a very energy saving building. So that's why we uh, adapted uh, some smart solutions. We are using solar panel to represent up to 50% of energy savings. We use the water from Vltava River to cool and heat the buildings. Energy saving of buildings is a part of a bigger project which is called Smart Prague. There are some obstacles which the citizens are not value. For example, in terms of transportation, it's not always easy to get from one part to another. We want to bring more comfortable life in Prague for our citizens. They can find you know, more parking place, they can use a faster transportation. This is a smart LED lamp. It's part of the smartification of our city. You can gather important data in terms of pollution of air and noise. This is important for our data platform and for city planning. Thanks to this lamp, we are smartified our lights in Prague. So we are using the LED technology to save more energy and also you can charge your car just plugging in. Prague is gonna be bigger and bigger. I think we need more efficient management. The international cooperation learning from other cities is very important to learn from each other and to share opinions and experiences to actually save also money in terms of implementing uh, smart solutions. The Committee of Regions is actually the best platform how to spread around this idea. Those are representatives which are directly responsible for managing of cities and the regions. By approximately 2050, 85% of all the citizens will live in cities. Intelligent management of the city based on data evaluation is the future.